right guys get your glue guns ready because we are back and we are going to be doing some Valentine's Day crafts um, and I've got my little helper Lucas here with me he is probably just going to be hanging out <laughs> probably not doing a whole lot um, but any crafts that I do I have on my Valentine's board and on Pinterest that I will link in the description down below so make sure you guys go check that out too it'll have all the instructions on it um, for you to go ahead and follow candle holder and then you put your ball in there start taking your flowers and I would push up the leaves the best you can so you can get some leaves in there as well and then I have wire cutters because I used to do um, floral arrangements with artificial flowers all the time so I already have some scissors will probably work and if you if you bend it enough times it works as well so, um, but anyway, the only thing that you need to do here is just take your stems and stick them in the ball. This is obviously a lot easier with an actual styrofoam ball, um, but then just keep doing that until you have flowers all the way around it. So camera did stop filming for some reason, but I ran out of red flowers, so now I'm just going to add in the white flowers and take out some of the red ones and move them to fill in these empty spots here. I did put the candlestick on as well so I could kind of judge um, where to put things, and I also did the small side down just so I didn't have to use more flowers, um, but I think so far one, two... I think this has used six flower stems, so I would definitely get like seven or eight, maybe even nine, just to be on the safe side. And then this is the finished product, and I'm actually going to add a few things. I have my basket of ribbon here. I am actually going to add like these sprigs down below with hot glue. 